Hey guys, Deering Dave, I got a treat for you. Um, I was invited to go down and film some antique flywheel engines, um, hundreds of them. And this guy has got the rare stuff. So um, this, is, this is a real treat. So anyway, um, we'll get on with it. There's so many engines that Ryan just named, <clears throat> the name of the engine and the date and uh, sometimes where he got it. Otherwise, um, there's so many. We're just going to go over the engines that are on the wall. He's got them stacked on industrial shelves all the way around. And then we'll go over the four models in the second video. Um, there are some tractors and some automobiles. But uh, by and large, it's just uh, unique, obscure, small anti-flywheel engines. So um, grab some popcorn and enjoy. Get up there. I mean, come on. <laughs> What, if you see something you want to know what it is, I'll tell you. But. Okay. Well, um, I guess i point out the rare ones. I mean, because I, I would assume some people know about some of these engines, but then some of them well, the even one, I haven't seen before. So I mean, the one in the top right-hand corner up there, that's a horse-and-a-half domestic, but it's a Shippensburg domestic with the fuel pump and stuff on it. Okay. And the one to the left of it is a Patton Brothers. Uh, one of the ones that runs back yeah, with a vertical governor. Okay. Uh, let's see. Come down a little bit. There's a really nice peerless, little two horse peerless side shaft up there on the right hand side. Okay. Some just uh, other oddball stuff in there. Then to the right, there's a real nice little uh, horse and a half type F domestic. There's a one horse T1E with the Indian head on the side of the hopper in front of that. To the left of that's a one and a half Messinger hopper cooled, and behind that's a one a three quarter horse Messinger air cooled. There's a Stuart Little Major there. There's okay. a little Myrick Junior behind there, which is Myrick. It's a Myrick. It's a Myrick Eclipse M Y R I C K, I think. Huh. But it's Myrick Eclipse Junior. It's an Eclipse Junior. It was actually like a. I've heard of an Eclipse. Eclipse. Well, it's, yeah, but it's a Myrick Junior. Well, it was different. They merged. No, or no, it was a it's the same thing. But they didn't make very many of them. I don't know. It was, I oh, which it's like a model of the well, Eclipse. No, it's it's an actual engine. It's back there. You can't yeah. see it hardly. But oh, it's oh, I see. Oh, I see. It's they kind made, of behind. There I don't now. know. They made like not many of them. There's not many out there today. Oh, and there it is. Guy. Okay. Yeah, it's cute. Air cooled. Yeah. Okay. What we got here on the bottom line? Um, what's this one? That's a Galloway masterpiece from, but it's ta it's tagged different. It's from Quebec. Okay. Uh, there's a nice, reliable air cooled, reliable side shaft down there in the bottom. I see it. Yeah, that's an oddball engine. There's a Foos J back there. I've heard of a Foos. Light, light, <laughs> light six sandwich. Mm -hmm. This is a rare engine. That's like 1897. That's a vertical Abenaki. Two cycle. Uh, patented from, they call it, the engineer was Austin Berg. It, that's like non-existent. I think that's the only one. Mm -hmm. This is this nice engine here. It's missing a cylinder. Well, I got the parts for it. I had to do the cylinder in it. Okay. And I just never put it back together. It's all oh, it's got a big pulley on it, too. Yeah, wow. that's a four-horse famous. Four-horse wow. screen-cooled famous. But, yeah, that's got, that actually has the dual-fuel carburetor. That's got the gas-gasoline carburetor on it. Hmm. So this was actually, uh, this was an international motor. Yeah, that's international famous. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's just hard to, it's, well, without, like I said, without the, the cylinder, the it's cylinder kind of hard to that's I did the, recognize. I did the cylinder, yeah. <laughs> yeah. This was like on a wagon, wasn't it? Because it's got a little seat there. Yeah, that's a factory skid. Oh, it's a factory skid. And so the, the horse drag it dragged the, it, drag it through, through the, the mud. Right through the field. <laughs> right by the horses. Yep. Nice. It's a pump jack. So that, that's not a Nobo. It's uh, an Eclipse? That's a monitor. Oh, monitor. Okay. Yeah, that's a Fuller Johnson. That's a monitor. Okay. That's a Lazier engine right there with that weird little hot. Lazier. Yeah. A lot of guys think it's a peerless, but it's really not a peerless. It is looks the, like a peerless. Is that the huh. piston trip igniter? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's that wood. The red one? Yeah. That's a pretty early three horse domestic. That's really rough. Three horse domestic? 
Like yeah, two oh, and a yeah, half here. famous up there. Yeah, I got famous? a two and a half famous with every ignition on it they made. Huh. Yeah, there's four different options you could get for ignition igniter, the Podlesac Webster, the flat and bar the, Webster, and then the a gear drive Sumter. Okay. And I got one of each. Yeah, the flat bar Webster's over there. Yeah. Right? 1910? I don't know. Without looking at the serial number, I couldn't tell you. There's that Titusville headless I was telling you about, Dan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And like you said, the one that's up there. Oh, with the, with the square hopper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's consecutive serial number with that one. Okay. Yeah. Titusville. This Fairbanks T's. This come from Paul, right? Isn't that Is that a Paul Wright motor? It yeah. used to be years and years and years and years ago. Yeah. Years and years ago. What's it missing? The exhaust? Or Just what's a muffler. It? A muffler. Yeah, it run. It did run. That looks like a hot tube ignition, isn't it? Yes. That's early. This is, this is. Yeah, that this, is early. See, this is the one-piece cylinder base. This isn't exactly. flanged. Uh-huh. A lot of guys don't even know that exists. Because uh. they made that for a very, very short period of time because it was too hard to pour the casting and they all broke in half. Uh-huh. <laughs> Corn sheller? That's a rare engine. That's a Scott and Ewing right there. Okay. There's not very many of those. Scott out. Ewing. Yeah, Scott and Ewing. I think that's Bluffton, Ohio or something, I believe, maybe. Yeah. Early style Davis Galloway, Ron Rod Galloway, but it's a Davis Galloway. Davis Galloway. Yeah. Davis made... Yeah, Waterloo's. Some of the early Waterloo's were Davis Waterloo's. Okay. There. Six horse, new style McVicker. Five horse, old style McVicker. Vicker. Here's a killer nice original painted. International. Two and a half international. That's a Titan. That's a Titan. Yeah, but nice. that's the one with the gear Look drive the mag on it, all original yeah. paint and decal. You see the decal? Wow. Yeah, that's, that's a super pristine. Nice Still has part of the grand prize decal from the World's Fair. On it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Man, look at all the engineering on that sucker. Whew. That's an air cooled famous there. Famous? Yep, that's air cooled famous with the prop pump set up. Vertical. Mm -hmm. What yeah. pump is it? Is it heat going pumps? No, it's uh, right there yeah. on the side. Dayton. Lucas. Lucas. Dayton, Ohio. Yeah. That's got beautiful original paint with the everything on that. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you won't find too many air cooled famouses, especially that. Night. And more. Yeah, that's a more sure cool four horse more sure cool with a screen radiator. Yeah, that's an interesting piece. That was made in Greenville, Michigan. Michigan. Yeah, Greenville, Michigan. Hmm. That's a very early. That's a standard uh, gas engine company out of Cleveland. Okay. Yeah, but that's a real unique one with the igniter and the glass carburetor and stuff on it. Huh. Every other one of those, you'll see a spark plug. What's with the big ball? But I've seen well, that was your before. pressure. Yeah. Okay. That was your head for your pressure. I see. Another early domestic. Domestic. Early style domestic. Really nice. Somebody looks like somebody restored it. Yeah, it was well done. Mm -hmm. Early style tank hold Jake with the brass carburetor and a brass rod and stuff in that. Okay. I love the riveted tank. <laughs> Another nice original domestic, newer style, but it's a farm engine, it's not a pump engine. Okay. Good paint, pinstriping, there's a vertical auto. Uh, this is worth noting, this is a Sterling Charter, a two-horse Sterling Charter. Sterling Charter. Yeah. Hmm. That's cool. I've never seen a muffler like that before. Fuller Johnson? Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, and a Foos. Yeah, the Foos. Looks like it's still got the pump on yeah, it, right? Yeah, it's a factory mast pump with a Foos Junior with a mast pump. Uh -huh. 
and look like it's missing something. No, it's huh? a stove. Yeah. Is it? Mm -hmm. That's a Bates and Edmonds. The copper tanks look great. Yeah, horse and a half pumper. <laughs> yeah. Horse and a half Bates and Edmonds pumper. Yeah. It's a peerless vertical, peerless pumper. Just peerless. peerless. The Benz and Lorenz. Benz and Lorenz. Yeah, that was German. That one's Czechoslovakian. Oh, they're imports. Yeah, the, Czech, the Czechs. The Czechs copied the Germans on this. The Benzes were older than the Lorenzes. It looks like they got the same mag on them. What are they? That's a Sumter mag, I think, right? Or Bo that's a Bosch that's mag. A, it's a Bosch. Bosch. I, I yeah. go ahead. I have to be. <laughs> yeah, that's a Bosch mag. Yeah, Benz is like that was early German. German sure. Technology. Now is this? This would be. Well, wasn't there an American Bosch and a German Bosch, Dan? Well, right. German Bosch was first, and that's Germany. American Bosch is what American Bosch was later. Yeah. I'm assuming these are probably. I'm assuming these are both probably German. Bosch's. Yeah. Obviously. That's probably one of the hardest international harvesters to find. That's a three it's horse. It's a vertical. Yeah, it's a three horse hopper cold famous. Uh huh. Uh, but the, there's a lot of them out there that are twos, but there's not very many threes. That's a pretty rare engine. Doesn't look like you ever had that running. No, I never messed with that. But for an international guy, that's kind of a hard engine to find. Uh huh. That's a four uh, four horse, uh, yeah, four horse Shippensburg domestic, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do nice restoration on that one up there. Uh, that was one of our first engines years ago. Oh, really, yeah, economy? Uh, we did all that in the early nineties. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Associated. <laughs> What's this one here? Gold Shepley Mirror. Okay. They were doing tractors there for a while, weren't they? Uh -huh. well, there was a big, the big Gold Shepley Mirror up in the other building, you opposed. That yeah, 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 I saw that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Corn sheller, wooden. Yeah, it's a Messinger sheller. <laughs> this is interesting here. In the open side, in case. Honestly. <laughs> Bunch of junk under here and up there. We're just going to, you have to clean some of these things off with this, you know, to clean them up. Yeah. The stuff you see when sometimes falls down, you know, and off. Well, or yeah, really, if you Another domestic? We got a lot of domestics. Shelter, I like domestics. I guess you can get a crane if you did it with slant, right? Yeah. There's an air-cooled domestic right there. That's mm -hmm. awesome. there. There's a three-horse in Ocean Governor to Alamo. That should be put on something. Why domestics? Why do you... I don't know. Prefer those. Well, they look for them. They like run or? I don't know. I guess oh. I just like, I don't know. I just bought a lot of nice domestics over the years. Mm-hmm. There's another one behind it. There's a tank hold domestic back there in the back. Because you didn't even see that one hiding. <laughs> it was hiding. Yeah. This is probably the nicest spot I've on in existence. Two horses. Oh, My Jaeger. Jaeger, yep. That's a real me. It's a blue. Yeah. There's a little air motor with a mag. Little horn. Oh, oh, O L I N. Yeah, this is these are made in Oil City, weren't they? That's a buffalo oil. Oh, so there's two of them. There's two different oil. There's buffalo oil and there's a Titusville oil. Okay, so what's what's more rare? I mean, who oh, who made the most? Oh, were they? Oh yeah. I didn't. So the one Tyson made quite a few of them. Yeah. I didn't know that. He spilled the scene too. Stovepipe <laughs> domestic behind there. 
I wonder if that was a problem what? with the two Olins. I mean, was there a trademark I, or a patent problem? And, I'm sure there was some sort of problem. Because they were, they were constantly in and out of, you know, court back then with, mm -hmm. with uh, patents and whatnot. Bulldog. This is a cute bugger here. A little handy Andy Galloway. Yeah. Run your washing machine with that. What's that one back there? Falk. Spell that. F A L K. Really? Never heard of one of those. Yeah, it's got, I think I might have a Rumley Falk tag on it. I don't remember. Oh, Rumley made them? Uh, no, it was sold to a Rumley dealership. Oh. I believe, yeah. That's side shaft engine. Uh huh. That's a nice That's engine, Dan. I haven't had that out for years. Let's get it out. We'll fire it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Grab the fork truck. Although. I don't know where well, you'd crane. fit the fork truck. Can well, you can't even get it back here. <laughs> no, I decided to pull them off the shelves of a crane. I can pull them off oh, the Oh, that's right. Yeah, you've got the overhead crane. Yeah, well, that I makes mean, it I nice. It oh, off. boy. I, pull, I can pick anything up and take it right out of here. Yeah, that's... Even that's the stuff right. off the shelf. I sling it and I side pull it right off. Mm-hmm. Well, I was wondering how you did that. Oh, yeah. I mean, I pulled, just pulled some shit off of here the other day. Yeah. I suppose going back on would be the same deal, just push it in as you learn. D E Y O? Deo. Deo Macy. Never heard of that one. That's gearless, believe it or not. Really? Yeah. It's displayed the wrong way. Yeah, I'd like to see the other, the other side. The other side's probably a little more interesting. Huh. Yeah, there's stuff up there on the top. Yep. Yeah. You can't really even see it. Right. Good thing your uh, roof isn't 20 feet high, or we'd never see any of this. I'd be too high to well, see it. Well, you got to go up. <laughs> Apparently. You always got to go up. There's a little... What's Maybe that an end? That's a model end with a Jaeger. That's an original Jaeger end. Yeah. Hmm. Sandwich. Yeah, horse and a half mm -hmm. sandwich. Hmm. This one's a little out of the place. Yeah, that's brand new though. <laughs> Is it? That's new old stock that's never been run. <laughs> the bike? Really? Yeah. That's an Aprilla race bike, yeah. Not street legal, but. Hmm. Okay, so what's the story with the Griggs? You just got it because you got a deal on it, or is there some sentimental? Uh, no, it's just it's stuff out of norms. Yeah, okay. Now but you got to admit for a nice little Model A or Model B. Oh, yeah. You got to admit for a nice little Model A or Model B. Oh, yeah. It's nice. That's an early one, too, with your yeah, Model A. Mm hmm. Yeah, the air cleaners are always missing on that. Yeah, the air cleaners <laughs> are always safe. missing on that. Cannonball safe. That's interesting. <laughs> I've never seen one. Cannonball safe. That's interesting. I've never seen one. Was it a style or was it a make? Was it a style or was it a make? Oh, just a style then, right? Yeah, they call it the 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 Oh, just a style oh, okay. then, right? Yeah, they call it the 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 breech locking. Oh, uh, okay. Actually the yeah, this one's actually breech locking and that huh. one actually threw the door for it. Like action threads. So, What's, is so this is where you screw it? Okay. What's, so this is where you screw it? Interesting. Okay. Interesting. And a Model T. Right? Yeah, and a Model T. Right? Yeah, yes. The for the case I remember the, the case. Case. Yes. I remember the case. That's an old one. This is what? 15? No. That's an old one. This is what? Well, 15? No. 18? Wow. Well, 14. Wow. Yeah, it was right there where it could have been brass radiator. Yeah, it was right there where it could have been brass radiator. It could have been brass radiator. I think its title was a fourth. Yeah, there's that big money economy you walked right past. Yeah, there's that big money economy you walked right past. All the big money ones. That was the big money and a half sandwich. There's another horse and a half sandwich. Now, I want to stay on the wall here. Get distracted. Now, I want to stay on the wall here. Get distracted. Another vertical? 
That's a non perial. Uh, another a vertical? Non That's a non perial. That's a full force non perial fame. It's international. It's a lot of fame. It's a non perial. It's a full force international non perial. Huh. Doesn't look like you had this and run for quite a while either. No, I never ran. Doesn't look like you had this and run for quite a while either. No, I never ran. An eerie. I bought that out of From a collector, I assume? An eerie. From a collector, I assume? Some huh. old guys up there that had half a dozen engines. That's cool. Huh. They had a sale. Dad, you look at that upright May tag. Is it an upright May tag? Is it an upright May tag? Did you look at that carburetor on an upright May tag? Yeah, really like a really huh. yeah that's got the all above uh, carburetor on it. Huh. Stover Duro behind it. Stover Duro behind it. Mm hmm. See the one behind it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Over. They've got to be like the Chevrolet of the one-cylinder engines. I've seen. They've got to be like the Chevrolet of the one-cylinder engines. I've seen. They must have pumped a bunch of those things out. They must have pumped a bunch of those things out. Well, that all the newer stuff. Well, so how, you, well, how, stuff, how, yeah. how old's this motor here, do you think? So well, how, you, well, how, how, how old's this motor here, do you think? Twenties? I mean, it's throttle governed CT1. I mean, it's throttle governed CT1. It's interesting, it's got a sprocket on it. You should see a pedal. It's interesting, it's got a sprocket on it. You should see a pedal. see a pulley instead of Well, actually, that looks like it's 1935. Well, actually, that looks like it's 1935. They put casting. 35. Yeah, they they put casting dates on the side. That's late, late. Yeah, that's disc real, 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 that's late, late. And, you know, yeah. real, 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 real. That was probably in the cement. End of the, end of the era stuff. That was probably in five horse? Six. Six. International. Mm -hmm. that's it's five horse? Six. Six. International. Okay. Early that's one piece base. That doesn't have the space up. Okay. That's an early style. Huh. With the base doesn't have the space up. Base set up. This would be like huh. base and casting one piece. That's a huge base. This would be like 1906. That's a huge base. Coffee grinder, yeah. commercial. The rest of it's up Coffee there. grinder, yeah. commercial. The rest of it's up there. There's that flat bar in action right there. There's that flat bar in action right there. You said flat bar? Yeah, flat what makes it flat bar? Yeah, you said flat bar? Yeah, it's what makes it flat bar? Yeah, bag is bizarre. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that bag is bizarre. Yeah. Who, made the, yeah. who made the mag, Dan? It's a Webster. And who made the, who made the mag, Dan? Webster. Oh, Webster. Webster. Yeah. Webster. Webster. Oh, Webster. Yeah. Mm. Mm. There's like a, like a primer. Is that what you're doing? Pumping fuel. a fuel pump. Yeah. The fuel pump circulates the gas through the Yeah, because the tanks should be in the base. But the weather dries up and then you won't. Once you get it primed, it'll be well, a baby. Baby stick. Okay, folks, that concludes part one of Ryan's Antique Engine Collection. Stay tuned for part two. It has yet to come. Um, I'm going to go back down and take a visit and go through the second half. We didn't have time, actually, the first time to go through the whole thing. So uh, we're going to do we're going to do a second shoot later on. But uh, subscribe and like so that when I do let, download uh, part two, um, you can see, you know, the, the rest of the collection. So uh, until then, like, subscribe, and, and see you on the flip-flop.